Welcome back to NTV Skid Life. We are so very blessed to have Ron Pontine, Rod Pontine joining us today. The Bar and Candle Company mm. in Hastings. I'm telling you what, there's a fragrance oh. and a scent for everyone. First of all, give us a little bit of background, Rod, on you, your family, everything. Oh, Spill yeah. It. Okay, let's start it's with all family. About you. It's all about you. Well, I was born and raised in Hastings. I grew up... Uh, in Hastings, I, I started a lawn care business right after high school. I've done that since 1986. I attended Hastings College, graduated there in 92, started doing snow removal after that. Um, got married six years ago, and lawn care and snow removal is still very active. Been doing that for, I think the math is 28 years. Um, That's a long time to be doing those businesses. Yeah. But yeah. those seasons come, yep. and it's always going to be there. And you're <laughs> very much appreciated when it snows. Yep. And, and then, so, it's, so it's, you got married, and we got to give some shout outs because we know that some sweet little girls watching right now. Can I say hi then? Yeah. Hi, sweetie. Sadie is home with uh, uh, my, my two and a half year old daughter, Sabrina. Hi, Sabrina. And then we just have a six week old baby, uh, baby boy, Riley. Oh, so congratulations. She You're a busy left. guy. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, and then so. you have a, I hope, Sabrina, I hope you're jumping up and down on the floor right now going, he said my name on TV, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty sweet. So is it a, is it a family business? Very much. My okay. sister actually runs this business for me because I'm busy with a lot of other things. Okay. Uh, my sister, Shelly Niemeyer, is the, uh, I, I don't know what her job title is, operational manager. I boss. Would, boss. Yeah. Whatever she wants to have a title <laughs> on. Um, and then a couple of the great gals that really do a great job doing this while I'm out trying to keep everything else afloat and going. And so this was just something neat that I thought, you know, you can do this 24 hours a day, seven mm -hmm, days sure. a week. Yep. We actually, uh, in the last, we bought this in July of 2011. Okay. Uh, my wife and I just decided this would be kind of fun to do and maybe eventually get me more home and spend more time with the family. And it's neat because you can sell this on the internet 24-7. Yes. So. And so when you bought the company and you're thinking candles, I mean, I can see your wife saying, yeah, candles, that's fun. What was your thought? Candles? Or did you think, yeah, I don't, yeah. I've always forward. wanted an internet business because I know there's people mm -hmm. who make money on the internet every day. Mm -hmm. yep. And so this is a, it's a usable product. They use it up. It's gone. They, they need more. You're right. Yeah. And it's a luxury. So if people don't want it, they don't have to buy it. It's not a mm -hmm. life or death thing. So it's. So if gift, they get it, it is. Thing it's, it's, it's a wonderful gift. So we sell a lot of them for gifts. So, so what you have, have, oh, go ahead. What have you learned in the last two years? Because you bought the company in what, 2011? Mm -hmm. July of 2011, yeah. What have I learned? The list is long. Um, I learned I can't do everything. My family helps me out a lot. Um, my mom is the accountant. My dad is my right hand man, helps me with everything. My sister runs the business. Um, I've just learned a lot about candles because I didn't know really anything about them. It was just, it was a business that I thought. I knew it was in Hastings for a long time, and, and they developed a great product. Um, I just thought it'd be something fun and, and exciting to do, and, and that it has been. So. so people that are in Hastings right now, they might be thinking, where can I go? And there's the address. Tell us where your business is located in Hastings. We don't actually have a retail spot. We, have a, we manufacture at a farm that we actually owned out in the country. We actually bought the business and moved everything about five and a half miles down the road. Okay. okay. So we have a manufacturing plant out in the country, um, just out by the airport. Mm -hmm. you know, we have a couple of retail locations in Hastings. We have Journey uh, Books and Cards Gifts downtown. Mm -hmm. And then uh, the total package on South Burlington, and then we're in the grow stores in both Kearney and Grand Island. We actually have wholesalers all over the country. We've actually sold candles recently wow. to the United Kingdom, and I believe it was Switzerland. Oh my so we've goodness. gone international. So that so is awesome. If there's a business out there that would like to have your candles in their business, can they contact you at that number, or how do they get in touch with you? Yeah, barncandles.com, okay. or they can check us out at the 800 number. Right? You said it was on the screen, so mm -hmm. um, this is our fundraising program. This, yeah, is a, this is a huge part of our business. What um, a great idea. We do fundraisers for all organizations, whether it's cheerleaders or your youth group or mm -hmm. the band. Um, just anybody needing to raise money, it's a, it's a fabulous program. They, uh, they just, we only have a small little sample here. We have uh, about the 40 different fragrances here. I don't know if you oh, can see Oh, there's only 40. Okay. There's only wow. 40 on the brochure wow. of different items, but overall we have about 1,000 different smokes. products. That's a lot. Wow. We have about 100 different scents, and then we have them in the five different jars. If you want, I can kind of go into what those are. Okay, we can do that, and you have a, two new fragrances that we need to highlight when we come back, so stay with us. All right, nice. 
Carol, we, Carol oh. has a lot of happy places, and we're in a oh, happy place. Happy to have Rod Shabon. joining us today. The Hello. Bard, Rod. Yeah, you, what? You, everybody good? Yeah, I'm good. What? All right. I'm just Bar and Candle Company in Hastings. He's got, four, okay, you have how many different fragrances? Um, a total we have 97. 97. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you have two that we can unveil today. Is that right? Yes, ma'am. Okay. And they would be? Amethyst da -da -da -da. Gardens and Cuddly Fresh. <gasps> okay. Look at that. And just look at the color in itself. It's, I love the baby blue color. Is there a story behind this? Well, we have a six-week-old baby boy at home, so we needed something baby boyish. Oh, we already have a pink color. one, so and, love uh, that. And the other thing too, you know, and maybe we didn't touch on this enough. The the Barn Candle Company does everything their own from scratch. As far as you said, you go out and buy these jars, mm -hmm. and then you probably have a big old vat of wax, and you got your fragrance fragrances and your. So you must be mixing and smelling all day long. How long does it take to make these candles? Well, surprisingly, we got a pretty good system down, so it doesn't take too long. Mm -hmm. When we pour candles, we pour anywhere from 60 to uh, a couple hundred at a time. We can wow. pour 1,000 candles in a day, or if we really get after it, we can even pour more than that. But yeah, we have a big vat. We melt it. We take mm -hmm. it into a smaller vat, and that's where we add the, the colors and the fragrances. Mm -hmm. And then we actually literally mm -hmm. hand pour every single wow, candle. We're, we're not really? automated. We put the wicks in. and. The labels on it's a very time consuming job but you can tell by looking at them the quality oh, we I, that's our it, quality yes. is top notch and so. the different the different style of the jars well i, I was just going to say the, the different sizes that's what i'm impressed with and the lids even the lids themselves everything is just sleek and elegant looking that's what i that's what i like about these. and this is our elegant line so that's a good word for oh, these a good way to introduce the <laughs> elegant jars a lot of people know the barn candles is mm -hmm. the square mason jars Mm -hmm. But it's the same fragrance, same wax, just in a different jar, mm -hmm. a little more sleek, a little more elegant. And then we also have a reflective light line, which is both the small and the large. Mm -hmm. We have uh, we have some with Bible verses on them, as well as just Very inspirational nice. sayings. Very nice. Um, what I like, the what I think just tops everything is you get a, a matches with it. I that know. is a nice little touch. You know how many touch. times I have to run around the house looking for matches for candles that I buy? Every time. Not when you buy a barn candle. I know it. I uh, love that. We actually, that. you just opened a door. We uh, we can actually do a customized matchbook if I can find it. Oh. We can put your own private label on a matchbook. You are kidding. We right. can do it all. Look what What is that? What? It says like, love on it. Country Rain is the... Country uh, Rain? But we that. stick our own stickers on them. We actually cut and make our own labels for these candles. Mm -hmm. These are the reflective light, and when it burns down, it actually burns through these labels, and so the light reflects through the labels, which is very pretty to burn. That but, is genius. Look at that. Isn't that neat? So you can, you do the match. You do all of that yourself. Do all yes. of these. Wow. Wow. And we have. What? And your sister saying what? The in incense? Is that what? Wait, well, she's, what? What? We, we kind of want to introduce these. These have gotten yes. to be very popular. These are called the barn bricks, and the people use them in their in their melters. Mm -hmm. You just break yeah, them out, they pop right out. You break them apart and put them in your melter. And we have again every scent available in the in the yes. barn bricks. What about the candle tops? Do you have those as well? We have all the accessories available. My wow. sister actually uh, was painting on this one. Oh my um, We have the reed diffusers. We have the room sprays. And we have some secret things that we're coming up with later this summer. We have a brand new website coming up here. Great. Within about a week, we'll have a brand new wow. website, okay. hopefully live. And then when we get that going live, we have some, some really cool new things coming up that we will introduce this summer. Mm -hmm. So, Rod, man scents. Too. You know, they have the, there's some scents for men. You know, I've seen them that have, they smell like you mow a lawn. Yeah, there's exactly. one bacon. Have, is that something that you're we working on? We have a couple. We have some leather Ooh, ones, and we actually have one like called for one. men only. Okay. And I think it smells like pine trees. And sandalwood. That's what mm, I'm smelling yep. right now. Sandalwood, yeah. Sandalwood. Is that one? Yep. You like that one, Ronnie? It doesn't quite smell like bacon, but it's close. We could. We could <gasps> maybe. Oh, I like that. I mean, that that would. <sighs> oh, that is nice. Yeah. That. This is my personal favorite right <sighs> here. How can you? How, do you have a? How could you find a favorite? So how long does I one like. of these? burn then? Approximately 120 hours. For That's, this size? Yeah, and they burn all the way to the edge and all the way to the bottom. So you don't have to worry about losing the wick in the... No. Nope. This is my favorite. See, that's what always happens to me. Oh. What about the bigger ones? This is my favorite. And like this, this one? Get, oh, is, is that 120 this. hours as well? That's a the good elegant? question. Okay. I, we'll, we'll be testing it in the in the factory or... I, I, I don't know the answer to that so question. So if somebody is out there thinking, man, this would make a great fundraiser. To get in touch with you, what was the address? And all Barncandles.com. Okay. 
Oh. And so, and, the, do you, and then somebody will get right back to them? Yep, yep. They can ask a question there or they can call the 800 number, 608-6922. Okay. okay, I'm telling you, friends, Amethyst Garden. And I'm, I'm going to tell you, want it. I smelled a lot of candles. These have the aroma and the fragrance is like bursting out of the out of the jar. Yeah. I mean, as soon as you you don't even have it opened and it I smells. Like this. I put these in my car, and I don't. Oh, I just I just set it in there. I just set an open box in my car and it makes my car smell better. Because I was never into candles. I'm. I drive trucks and I'm old cars and I get, I get That's dirty. That's a sweet smelling and, truck you got there, friend. Uh, <laughs> well. And I love it. This is great. I, I, mm. I don't know if I could pick a favorite. Although I do know right now it's the Amethyst Garden. Yeah. We could be smelling all day. We could be. Thank we you. could decorate the studio with some barn candles. We could. Okay, that's our next goal. Okay. Right. <laughs> it looks really good back here on the shelves. All right. Sounds all good. All right, Rod, thank you for being thank with you. us thank again. You. It's always a pleasure, yeah. and you're welcome back anytime. If you want more information, go ahead and check out their website, and we'll have a link to that on Nebraska.tv as well. All right, gang, stay with us because after the break, Carlos is here.